Jetpack 1993 short video game review. You take on the role of an adventurer out for treasure, specifically gems, at least those are the ones you have to get in order to unlock the exit of a level. You can also collect gold, and it's a pretty good idea because it grants you extra lives. The game, the entire screen consists of a ton of these squares, and you basically have to maneuver yourself. You know, it's a platform action adventure game, and by today's stand standards, pretty retro. The graphics are, of course, dated, but the gameplay is still a ton of fun, and it's a really addictive game. You can make your own levels for it, and other people have made entire level packs for it. It's free today, I will put a link down below, and though you'll, you'll probably want to use DOSBox to make it run properly, also a link below. The game really requires you to plan ahead and predict what your actions are going to cause. And it basically the enemies tend not to be out to get you as much as just in your way. And you can't actually hurt them, you can only avoid them, trick them, and trap them. The game gets a lot of possibility out of barriers and teleporters, which are color specific and which can either help you or hurt you, and sometimes, you know, both in the same level. The level designers had a lot of humor, and there are several references to other popular video games from the period. The, the jetpack itself is, it takes practice to properly control, and it, to an extent, follows the laws of physics. All in all, just a really, really fun game if you're into, you know, games from this period, and I urge you to try it out. If you like this review and want a more detailed one, check below, it's there as a video response. If not, it'll be in the description box. Please rate and comment, and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.